Hydrogen versus Anti-Hydrogen, the ultimate cosmic duel. Hydrogen is the simplest and most abundant element in the universe, consisting of one proton, plus charge, and one electron, charge, but what if we flip the charges? That's where anti-hydrogen comes in. It's the antimatter counterpart of hydrogen, made up of one antiproton, charge, and one positron, plus charge. Why does this matter? Anti-hydrogen is extremely rare it only forms in high-energy cosmic events or advanced particle physics labs. But here's the real shocker. If hydrogen and anti-hydrogen ever meet, they annihilate each other completely, converting 100% of their mass into pure energy. This follows Einstein's famous equation, E equals mix squared. This makes antimatter the most efficient energy source known far more powerful than nuclear fusion or fission. But before you start dreaming of antimatter-powered spaceships, there's a problem. It's incredibly difficult to produce and store. Even a tiny amount could unleash unimaginable energy, but keeping it from touching normal matter is nearly impossible. What if we could harness antimatter? Could it power the future of space travel? Or does it remain a science fiction dream? Let me know what you think.